Hi, it's John Lane from TaxHillList.com. If you don't know about TaxHillList.com, we're the website that provides tax sale lists, over 10,000 a year. And we've been doing that for the past almost 12 years now. And we also provide the only tax sale training done by someone who's been a major buyer of tax liens. What do I mean by major buyer? Purchased over 77,000 tax sale properties over the past 20 years. Today I want to cover a subject that a lot of people really don't understand, and that is how can I find a property that I want to bid on in a tax sale? Now this is a subject we spend over three hours on in our workshop, so I'll just cover the main points in this video. The process is called due diligence, which is a fancy term for doing your homework. It's a two-step process. The first step of due diligence is to eliminate everything you have no interest in. You don't want to spend any time finding out about properties you don't want to buy. To do this, you need your tax sale list to be either in an Excel or some other software form that allows you to sort the list. Let's face it, you can't sort a list if it's just on a newspaper. Typical list may have 4,000 properties on it, but only 250 interest you. You have to cut down that list quickly. We show you how to cut a 5,000 property list to just 300 properties in less than 25 minutes on our workshop. And this is a critical skill you need to have. The second step is to analyze the property you're interested in and to eliminate those that don't meet your criteria. And there are a number of mathematical clues you can use. Things like lean to value ratio, improved value to total value, as well as standard criteria such as square footage, market value, bedrooms, bathrooms, zoning, zip code, and finally, eyeball. Looking at the property is important, but it can be done online. Remember, it is the neighborhood that is most important, not the structure itself. To sum it up, the due diligence process is a two-step process. Step one, eliminate everything you don't care about, you can't afford to spend time on those that don't interest you. Step two, analyze those you do care about and eliminate those that don't meet your criteria. As I said before, this is a subject we spend over three hours on in our workshop. It's important to learn all the details of due diligence. Tax sales are very profitable as long as you do proper due diligence. If you'd like to learn more, we regularly hold a free one-hour webinar that'll answer a lot of your questions about tax sales. To register, just go to http colon slash slash www.taxsellist.com slash free slash 290, or even easier, click the link below in the description. This is John Lane thanking you for attending. Hope to see you on the inside. Have a great day.